This Liberty Sports Update is brought to you by Beacon Credit Union. Our 2018 football position previews continue today with a look at the quarterback spot. Incumbent starter Buckshot Calvert returns for his junior season. Entering his third season behind center, Calvert leaves in his wake. Single season school records a year ago of 29 touchdowns and over 3,300 yards passing. Physically, the tools are there, and this season he's been asked to be more of a vocal leader. You know, when I came in, just a quiet guy. You know, the quarterback quarterback uh, position, you can't really be the, that quiet guy. So they, you know, they talked to me. They told me to, you know, speak to my guys more, just encourage them as much as possible. And, you know, I felt like I really stepped up at, at, at that uh, part that they asked me to. And um, I feel the guys feel like, um, you know, I, I'm making an improvement in that. And they see the improvement, and they're just – they're just hanging on and they, they believe in me and I just like I believe in them. So, you know, that's what it is. Joe Daly returns to tutor the quarterbacks in 2018 and has a few goals for this offense in the fall. Yeah, really our downfield passing is something that we've, uh, we've always emphasized and we had to figure out a way in order to complete more footballs. We were really good in third and long. Most of it was due to the fact that we were just chucking it deep. But we got to be better on first and second down with those deep balls because that's when you really get the coverage that you want. And so we made a huge emphasis on you know completing those balls, figuring out a way to make sure our guy comes down with that football when we throw a post, when we throw a go, when we throw a double move, or whatever we have dialed up. We got to figure out a way to make sure that our guy has that ball. And so uh, we spent a lot of time in the spring, uh, in addition to fall camp, working on those things. Battling behind Buckshot for the backup spot are juniors Mason Cunningham and redshirt freshman Landon Brown. Cunningham played in one game last season and is ready to assist wherever this team needs it. I mean, it's all about making Buck better and making the team better at that point. So, I mean, I'm a team guy, so I'm always trying to like, help the team to like make sure he's sharp with his reads and like challenging him. So I feel like that's like the biggest thing for a backup to do, for sure. This fall camp was an opportunity really for him to kind of show us he has total, under, total understanding of what we're trying to get done at all times. I thought he did a good job of managing the offense and demonstrating uh, his competence in, in regards to what we're trying to do uh, at all times. Brown redshirted last fall and used that time to garner knowledge from Calvert and Cunningham. You know, I felt like I took um, every rep um, with diligence and just tried to learn whether I was on the field or not, whether I was watching, you know, Mason or Buck, but take each rep. Um, and just learn as much as I could off of, off of that, um, but mainly just diligently looking at you know how they were doing things and trying to uh, emulate that. This fall camp, he did a really really good job of pushing the ball down the field. Um, you know, when he throws the ball on time, it's it's a really really beautiful thing, and so he showed us that he can do those things and he can manage the offense. You know, he's still uh, young in a sense; he's never really played in this kind of system, so he's still trying to figure some out some of the little details out, but for the most part, Landon, you know, he understands kind of how we operate. And, you know, as time passes, he will, you know, certainly understand exactly what we're trying to do, you know, in, uh, in all phases. 